Hey guys, so I just wanted to come on here and really quickly just say that this video is something that I filmed literally like almost a whole semester ago. I filmed this video when I actually still attended Georgia College. Now I don't go there anymore, I go to Kennesaw. But yeah, I guess I just never really uploaded the video because I didn't think it was good enough. But I kept the footage and I started looking through all of it again and I was like, this is actually not a super bad video. So I figured I would still upload it, especially right now since it's technically supposed to have been like move out season I hope you guys don't mind that but yeah I just figured I would redo the introduction and put that out there just so you guys know this is an old video honestly it was like so fun editing it and kind of looking back and seeing how much things change over just one semester so yeah don't forget to subscribe down below give this video a thumbs up follow me on Instagram Pinterest TikTok. yeah without further ado let's go on and get started with my college move out vlog My bed is literally so messy right now, but I'm just gonna start off by taking all of my bed sheets, folding them up, and then I'm just gonna take them to the car. This mattress is actually not mine, so it's gonna stay here. And then for the bed frame, I just like sold it to the person that's gonna live here next semester, so I'm gonna leave those two things here. But I think I am just gonna start off with my bedding and probably take these plants to my car as well. It's so sad, like this is the last time that my room is gonna look like this. Bedding is ready. I have all of my like main blankets right here, my decor pillows, my regular pillows, and then this little kind of like back pillow. Honestly, this one was so useful. So if you guys are like starting to shop for things for next semester or whatnot, definitely grab one of these. But yeah, I'm just gonna load everything in my car and then I'm also gonna load my plants in there. Whew, it's gonna be a long day, you guys. I honestly don't even know how I'm gonna organize everything yet. I guess I'll just start off by like putting my pillows like on the seats, I think. Ugh, this is such a struggle. I guess I'll kind of lay them down like this just because I need to use the floor to like put my plants or things I just stick up more. Okay, that was literally the first trip and I only brought three pillows. That is so sad. Bedding has been cleared out. I guess step two is um, taking my plants. I took one already, but I'm gonna take this plant and then my gold little lamp. Um, I need to disconnect it first, but where is it? <laughs> I always hate it when plugs are like all the way on the side corner of like your bed. This is so sad because this was probably one of my favorite parts of my room, but I'm gonna have to take down all of these little, okay, I cannot, I cannot for the life of me, okay. I'm gonna just have to take down all these little like wall decorations. These are just taped on, honestly, like they lasted the whole semester. I am planning on putting these back on the wall at home, but obviously like if they're too wrinkled, I won't put them back. So we'll just have to do those carefully. For the most part, everything went like pretty okay, but like 
this little print right here I kind of like got another one stuck together with it and then when I pulled it apart like it just yeah well basically that happened I just don't want the tape to touch the print so I don't know what exactly I'm gonna do honestly my room just looks so sad like with nothing in the walls anymore I stored all of the prints kind of like in some notebooks in my book bag next thing I'm gonna do is pull out everything that's under my bed just because I'm storing most of my items like in this plastic bin and in this Ikea bag then I have my printer honestly it is disgusting down here I never realized how dusty it got so I'm probably gonna sweep for the girl that's gonna come in next semester so she won't be scared <laughs> all the dust that there is oh darn it <laughs> my waffle Ugh. My waffle. Yeah, I definitely need to sleep under there. honestly can't remember where I left my mini waffle maker. I might have left it back at home. I also did find my little mini rice cooker um, and then I did put my ninja in the box but I need to like properly close it. Is this the right way? No. Hold up. There we go, okay. I'm also gonna be loading in my Keurig to its box as well, um, but I do need to like dump out all this water. Next up, I think I'm gonna put all of like my decorations in my laundry basket. I do have a little bit of Christmas decorations that I did put up on my cubby holes. And then I do have like a Christmas tree over there and just like some tinsel. So I'm gonna try to stick them all in here. By the way, most of these are from Target. I am obsessed with Target's like decor in basically any season of the year. By the way, I've had this thing since like literally when I moved in, so I probably should throw that away by now. I'm excited to actually put all of these Christmas decorations like back up in my room, back at home. So excited to finally be able to enjoy like Christmas without all of this extra stress from classes and school and all that. Another thing I love to do when like packing and stuff like that is putting like my jewelry in these bags that you get when you purchase literally anything from Glossier. I'm just gonna put like all my necklaces in here. They might still get tangled because I have a good amount of like dainty necklaces but i rather just have them all in one area so they don't get lost or anything also i do need to take my mirror i might put it in here if you guys are interested this one is from dormify i absolutely love it i think i'm just gonna put it in this like plastic bin I don't know. I honestly don't even have a specific method for organizing everything, but I guess we'll just kind of figure it out as we go. I am going to put this little winter candle as well in here. Going to take down this tinsel as well. Um, put it in here. Kind of like that. And then I also have this super cute little Christmas tree from TJ Maxx. So I'm gonna put that in here as well. I think I'm actually gonna make a trip to the car really quick and put this little piece of furniture in there um, just cause it's one of the more bigger items. So I need to make sure it goes in there first. Just a little update, honestly I don't have that many um items left to put in my car i was about to forget this little throw blanket that i like i've had here for forever honestly i even forgot it like was mine i need to put that in the car i think i'm gonna take this little basket next i would keep like my medicine in here and just like little things like that and this is my makeup bag oh yeah i actually got this little 
pretty little thing bag because I ordered some things for like Black Friday. I think I'm just gonna wait till I get home to open it because then if not, I'm gonna make like a mess out of everything. All of the decorations have been put in here for the most part, except this like little string light star thingy I got from Target. So I'm gonna do that up next. I actually just stuck in a bunch of clothing in my luggage. Um, all of that clothing was just like from this little Ikea storage drawer. Me and my dad are actually gonna have to come back and put this like in a truck because um, that's how we brought it in and honestly it just does not fit in my car. This is gonna stay here. I will be back to grab this. Um, but for the most part, I think everything else should fit. And again, if it doesn't fit, then it's no big deal. Like, I'm going to have to come back again later on to grab that drawer so I could, like, put other stuff in there. Let's see. I think I'm going to finish loading these things in. Another thing I do need to tackle is, like, my closet. I think I'm just going to lay all of these clothing pieces with their hangers on so I don't have to, like, take them off. And then I did end up putting all of my shoes in this IKEA bag right here, so... Overall though, everything else is looking good, so let's keep going. I do need to take off this curtain. I might give it to my parents because I do have one in my room already. Um, but either way, I'm gonna take it because it's so cute. And then I did put all of my items in this little storage compartment from Target. It's so, so cute. So I'm gonna take that out. Um, I think that's honestly it. I don't really have anything in these drawers, so. Yeah. Oh yeah, and I cannot forget my sponge. Everything is cleared out from the bathroom. It looks so empty, like there's nothing in it. And I actually did take out the little wooden thing right here that I just used to put all of like my skincare stuff and like bathroom stuff, so. This is my plant. I almost forgot my little plant. That's so sad. I guess I'll put it right there. Okay, so yeah, I guess this is it. Goodbye bathroom. This is so sad, okay. Yep, pretty much it for the bathroom. I think I'm gonna close up my luggage right now as well and kind of put everything like outside so I don't have to keep coming in here. Oh yeah, and then I do have to sweep, so yeah. Somehow I managed to just move everything here. All of these things are honestly ready to be loaded into the car. All right guys, so I basically got everything out there's a few things that are gonna have to stay here because they just literally do not fit in my car um, But my dad is gonna come back later on with his truck and we're both gonna take my Ikea furniture back And then my Ikea car also didn't fit on there. So pretty much it. This is so sad And also my closet is fully empty um, This was my roommates. So I'm gonna leave this here and then I honestly don't need this like acne face wash it like burned my face so i'm just gonna leave it there maybe somebody will need it i don't know all right so this is my last bag you guys i'm pretty much saying goodbye to this place for a little bit um i will be back for like my furniture and stuff so it's not like a complete goodbye just yet but yeah i'm gonna put this in my car let me also show you guys my car because it looks very just stuffed in there like i don't even know how i'm gonna drive home honestly but I literally have everything completely full like there's clothing on the other side I tried to squeeze in as much like as possible but to be honest I don't even know where I'm gonna put this bag probably back here hold up all right maybe if I lay it across I really hope I don't have anything like fragile in there, but it actually did close. But yeah, this is what I mean. Like this is just, I literally had to squeeze all my like dry foods and groceries in that bag and push it in. Oh yeah, and then I do have my freaking eggnog in here. It's so random. My car kind of smells like eggnog now and I kind of like it. So guess we're all set and ready to go. I hope I could see my mirrors. I probably should. I'll be fine. All right.